So I have decided that I am really going to try something new. I have never um, read the entire Bible. And so one of my friends and I said that we were going to read the entire Bible this year. And I'm just really trying my best to be intentional with reading the entire Bible this year. So anyways, um, Cain and Abel, I've read this story plenty of times. However, in the midst of me reading it again, God just started providing like new revelation to me. And I just want to say this, gone are the days where we feel like we can just offer any old thing to God and he has to accept it. Like gone are those days to where we feel like we can offer like God anything and he has to accept it. Like, no, just because you are offering it to God doesn't mean that whatever you have tried to offer to him was the best thing that you could have offered him. And so when I was reading Cain and Abel, I was like, wow, wow. And so for me, I'm a night aisle. So I like to do all of my Bible studying at nighttime. And so even if I go to sleep, you know, like between three or four o'clock in the morning, God is waking me back up at seven or eight or at between the hours of seven and eight o'clock and wanting me to seek him early. And I'm like, God, time is time. But no, seek me early, Clanisha. You go throughout the whole day doing whatever you want to do. And then when nighttime falls, you want to be in my word. I want you to be in my word first thing in the morning and allow that to set the tone for your day. Allow that to set the tone for your day. And so that's how um, God is wanting me. And so because I'm thinking, well, I'm doing good enough by offering you time when I have the time. God is saying, no, I want you to offer your time in the morning because that is when you are at your best. And see me, I be thinking that I be at my best at nighttime. But truthfully, I really don't be. Because I be tired and I be really having to force myself. And so, yeah, I just want to read this quick little verse. Okay. And in the process of time, it came to pass that Cain brought an offering of the fruit of the ground to the Lord. Abel also brought of the firstborn of his flock in their fat, and the Lord respected Abel in his offering, but he did not respect Cain in his offering. And Cain was very angry, and his countenance fell. So the Lord said to Cain, Why are you angry, and why has your countenance fallen? If you do well, will you not be accepted? And if you do not do well, sin lies at the door, and it desire is for you. But you should rule over it. Now. It's like so much to just really unpack there. But the thing that I really want to pay attention to the most is when God said, and if um, if you do well, will you not be accepted? Like. If you offer. God the things that he considers well he will accept it but if you try to offer God things that he does not consider well then it will not be accepted and so for me as I was saying time is time whether if it's in the daytime the midday or the nighttime time is time However, God, I'm going I'm to devote this time, 10, 11 o'clock, 10 to 12 o'clock at night. And God is saying, no, I don't want 10 to 12. I don't want 10 to midnight. I want 
five to six in the morning. I want six to seven in the morning. Like that's the time that I want. I want you when I want you when you are at your best, not when you are tired from the day. I want you first thing in the morning. First thing in the morning. Abel also brought of the firstborn of his flock and of their fat. First thing, God wants it first, not last. Not what you feel is best, God wants the best, not what you feel is best. So, as we continue on in this new year, I just want you to be very intentional about the things that you are trying to present to God. I want you to be intentional about the things that you are trying to give to God. I want you to be intentional about the things that you feel like is your best when you are trying to hand it over to God. Like, really think about those things and then ask yourself, is this really the best? And if it is not, then you need to try to offer God something else, okay? Until next time, y'all be easy. Deuces!